Yo, I just want to say I really appreciate you uh, tuning into my YouTube channel. Um, and if you're enjoying the content, don't forget to leave a like or a follow. It really does help me out a ton. All right, enjoy. Too unbreakable. Like the the first movie was genius. The other ones, me. Okay. You didn't we uh we actually Everything had like uh destroy you makes you stronger. Blade was a hard one because um it doesn't count. It's a vampire it's a vampire. We, we we count it under vampire section, not under superhero. You're doing great out there. If there weren't made one thousand billion Marvel clones, I could say that Iron Man one is good. I could say that Spider-Man with Tobey Maguire, the first one, is good, to some extent. The problem is it's been replicated so fucking many times that it's just not good. It's just, it's no, no. Just say no. Just don't do it. Niet. Not okay. There are nine million Moseses in Beijing. That's a fact. Da da dee da do da day. But the fact that I will love you until I die. Isn't there a way to eat the other Murloc? So it. Oh! Was it better to eat the other Murloc? Hmm. There are nine million bicycles Beijing. That's a fact. Moses will never be in Beijing. But if he does, there will be nine million bicycles. Things were pretty garbage back then, but I'm getting some weird enjoyment from it. I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I am enjoying it. I'm enjoying the, like, freedom. The artistic freedom. Because they definitely, like... They do not give a shit about capturing as wide audience as possible. They fucking go to town. They don't care if they alienate everyone. They're just going in there. Mo, if Nevels was watching you now, would you have something to say to him? I'd say, yo, buddy. Buddy, yo. Absolute abomination here. That's a big Murloc, though. Wanda Vision was amazing, at least. Wanda Vision was a fucking piece of shit. Also, Albert, thank you for the two months. I stopped watching midway through. I thought I stopped watching midway through with Loki as well, but it turns out. The season was just over. It just stopped like six episodes in and it, nothing had happened. I was like, oh, okay, that's 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 what it takes these days. What? One division was good, man. What? It was garbage. I'm sorry. Where's my demon at, yo? Better hire a recruit while you can. I will find the demon. And we will feast. What Marvel movie beats a DC movie? Let me ask you this. Is um uh, is the Batman trilogy DC?
Yes or no? Yes? Okay, the Batman trilogy, there is no Marvel movie that even comes close to the Batman trilogy. Not a single Marvel movie comes in the vicinity. Merry Christmas. La 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 Doesn't matter, like DC Verse is worse than Marvel Verse. Who cares? They both suck ass, right? That's what you need to know. Who the hell cares about this DC and Marvel? Just know that they both suck. If Batman isn't a part of the verse, then it probably sucks. The Batman trilogy is great. <sighs> kind of want to level here. That was a good hit. Kinda wanna find a five drop here. Did you watch the boys on Amazon? Yes, garbage. Starts off interesting one episode, then they told the line, becomes like every other fucking show ever. But they tried to like be different because of hyper violence. It's very uninspired. I would also say that the two main characters or the two guys that are fighting the superheroes are incredibly boring characters. Um, I would say Homelander is kind of interesting. Like it's, it's the one ray of light there, but they're not even close to being able to carry it. <laughs> Brando. Yes, I get a leaper. There we go. Daredevil on Netflix was badass. I I said it again. I said it many times. And I'll say it again. The the one good they had out of those Marvel series was um, first season of Punisher was actually pretty decent. Pretty decent. I took max damage here. That's unfortunate. Highly favored. This is actually a really good guy to eat here. Oh wow. Oh wow. That's gonna be a kick for me, my friends. Also, that's... Oh wow. What a shop. What an actual shop. I'll do this for scaling, and then I'll probably eat uh, one of these. A good tactical choice. Ugh. 
Like, I, I will say, I enjoyed Venom as well. Uh, it is, it is like one, another one of those just like replicas, but I still enjoyed it. Oh my god, did you hear that? My freaking neck cracked and it was almost a little bit scary. What did you think about Stranger Things? I'm gonna tell you something that is really sad. Because this is, this happens all the time. If you pay attention, you'll notice it too. It is actually really, really sad. It happens to so many shows. First season of Stranger Things was really, really good and really enjoyable. What happens is after they experience that type of success, they get pressured from Willy Wonka's within the movie scene that they have to make a new season and it has to be come out with some kind of deadline. And they've or they've spent like years on making this one concept, right? They spent a ton of time making this one concept. Um, and then suddenly they're supposed to pump out another one within a year. And then it just turns to garbage. And that's what happened to Stranger Things. And that's what happens to so many shows. They have like that one season that was like amazing. Couldn't have asked for more. And then... They pump out another one within a year. And it's just absolute garbage can. It's a trash can and a half. There was a scene in season 2... I think the girls... First of all, the villain in Season 2 is just... It's not interesting. Like, what the fuck is this? It's just shapes or some shit, if I remember correctly. But I remember... Um, when I stopped watching... Was when... If you haven't watched uh, Stranger Things already, I'm... Um, excuse you, dude. You're late to the party. But the thing that really gets me, and it gets me every time, it got me in uh, that uh, m the girl Marvel show on Netflix as well. Keep up the pressure. Is when people experience something traumatic and they're over it one second later, I'm just, I can't take it serious. I'm just, no. No. This is not okay. And, um... They do that in that, um, what's the, what's the one on Netflix that a lot of people like? It's not called Veronica Mars, but it's like a, it's like a double name superhero show. Jessica Jones, yeah. Uh, but in Stranger Things, I remember it's, um... They, um, I can eat this next turn. It's pretty okay. In straight, oh fuck, well, this is better. In Stranger Things, I think the girl's boyfriend gets murdered or gets eaten or some shit. And then, like, two minutes later, she doesn't give a shit and she's smiling and laughing. And I'm like, okay. All right, you may not have been the biggest fan of your boyfriend because obviously there was some feelings for that other dude, the cop guy, but your boyfriend just got fucking eaten, okay? Be sad. Anyone else just so easily entertain that almost any show and movie is enjoyable for me? That sounds nice. That sounds like someone who doesn't watch a lot of movies and shows. So it's like everything is fresh for you. That's kind of how I wish things were for me. Where you're like... Your receptors are so fresh... That... Any entertainment thrown your way is like a big win. You're like, oh, this 
Love this shit. Better hire a recruit while you can. Ooh, honest, good. Go big or go home, I always say. I hate me. Mm hmm 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 All right, I'll calm, calm down. We'll do it. My bad, it was pull ups. Wait, did you just make me do freebie Cobra Stretch? What the kick? Mm -hmm. Ah, it's fine, Streamline. It's on the house. You're a hard worker. Dead. First place, Andy. Coming in hot. <sighs> Is it true that Slate trousers fell off when he was doing pull-ups and his head no undies on? No, that was me. 